Hello everybody, welcome to Kindergarten. Again, if you're over the age of five or six, I am going to show you this game, which is full to the brim with dark humor, classic jokes, and kids just being kids on the playground and in classrooms and stuff. So, let's do this thing. Go to the piggy bank over here. I do believe that that's what every kid would do. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's just do this, man. Yep. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Excellent. Give me half or I'll split your empty skull on my foot. Fine, here, take your foot down. Good boy. I don't go tell the teacher about this or you might turn up missing like that Billy kid. I don't want to die like Billy. I'm going to tell the teacher though anyway. I miss Applegate. I have been well endowed <clears throat> with excellent teaching qualities. Bugs stole my money. He did? Interesting. I'll make a deal. Bugs is a real troublemaker. He's violent and a danger to others. If you go over there and challenge him, I'll make it worth your while. What if he hurts me? Uh, it'll build character? Is this legal? Probably not. But if this is how I can start my underground kid fighting ring, then it's a risk I'm willing to take. Fair enough. What's in it for me? I'll give you a gold star. We all love gold stars, don't we? Um, okay. Oh, how I love a good kitty fight. Just go over and push him a little bit. When he attacks back, just yell for me and I'll put a stop to it. Alright, cool. Take care of this little douche nozzle then. What do you want, dweeb? I'm not giving you your money back. Get out of here before I squish you. Squishing me won't make your dad come back. <laughs> My dad will come back. He just went to the store to get some cigarettes. So I'll get out of here. I'll beat you so hard it'll make him proud. He'll never be proud of you. Yes, you will. If you don't leave right now, I'll kill you. Die wouldn't be so bad. Fun, you asked for this. This is for you, Dad. Bugs. How dare you attack another student unprovoked again. That's the last straw. I'm sending you to the principal's office so he can finally expel you. No, please don't. He started. He's a liar. He said my dad was never coming back. Well, he's right. And after this little incident, neither are you. Now go to the principal's office, or I'll have the janitor carry you there. But, but, go! Stupid rat, we could have been friends if you didn't rat me out. Oh, happy day, I'm finally rid of that little degenerate. Here's your gold star as promised. Thanks. Hmm, now you've got me thinking though. Drum thinks he's so high and mighty because he's a principal's kid. Why don't we arrange a trip for him to visit daddy? Maybe we could. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Come see me during the morning time, and I'll tell you what to do. Nugget? I have a friend call me Nugget. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? I only have friendship. Heh, <laughs> perhaps that is all Nugget needs. You may have Nugget's Nugget. It signifies our friendship. Uh, thanks? Do not consume the Nugget of Nut. Do not consume the Nugget of Friendship, for, the for with its digestion, so too is our friendship digested. I won't. Good nugget, we'll see you later, friend. No more talking now. Shoo. Hello. Oh, um, hey, I'm Lily. You've probably heard about what happened to my brother Billy. I haven't. You haven't? It's been all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. Sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seems to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore me or insult me. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Why? I don't know. But if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. Thanks for the tip. Cindy! Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Wanna be my boyfriend? Sure. Heh, <laughs> that's what I like to hear. But first, you have to do something for me. Like what? You see that girl over there? She's Lily. She is by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. Got it? Sure. Oh yay, this could be so great. She'll finally get what she deserves, just like her brother did for dumping me. Come find me for, for morning time after you've done it. Go inside. Let's do this thing, guys. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you you can be. Yo, Monty. 
What, you want to be my morning buddy? Nah, I want to buy stuff. Take this. And this. Boom. I don't need nothing else, bro. Let's go put the shiz in Lily's hair. Bam! Yep, walk away. Yo, drill. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, come on. He told me he was going to save that for me. You can have it if you'll be my buddy. Extortion. At a kindergarten size level. <laughs> Thanks, chump. I guess you haven't learned how to tell tell time yet. Morning time is pretty much over. Oh. Aw. Did you do it? Oh my gosh, you totally did. Wait. Wow. What happened? Dude, what did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She cried. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy, which also makes you my boyfriend. As my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. Okay then, um, but before we do that, you need to get cleaned up. No way, your boyfriend of mine is going to bleed all over me. Go to the bathroom and wash up. I'll be over, I'll be over by a dollhouse. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't just leave class out of pass. Okay, can I use the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? May I use the bathroom? Wasn't it the worst when teachers did that to you? Oh my god, you used to get me so mad. Of course, now that you've asked correctly, here's the bathroom pass. Gee, thanks. Just be back soon. Hey, man. Aww. Oh, you're back. Alright, on time for lunch. Let's head down to the cafeteria, children. Go to lunch. Uh, Sub nugget? No one ever sits with poor Nugget. Nugget, I thought we already established that we were friends. Please don't sit with me. I don't want to talk to anyone until I find, until they find my brother. That's depressing. I figured you'd be seeing me around. I want to buy something. Here's what's for sale. Nah. Keep it. Sorry, sweetie. We're through. Better luck tomorrow. It's for the best. How you doing there, Sonny? Want some tasty, nutritious slop for lunch? Uh, okay, did I go to the bathroom? Oh, I'm not allowed to let any, like what? Well, I seem to have misplaced my glasses. I'll see what I can find. Spelled biscuit wrong. What? Oh, I didn't. Locked again. Ugh, is that, little, is that the dweeb of glasses? Who am I kidding? Of course it is. Hey, nerd. Um, what do you want? Got some JR stuff you want to sell me? No, but I got coffin for you to buy. Let this be a lesson to you about correcting people's spelling. Oh, the sound effects. Oh my god. There. Lessons were learned. Lines were drawn. You're a good kid for letting me know what that little monster was doing going around correcting people's spelling and in a school of all places. Shameful the way the kids turn out these days. Is he dead? What? No. I just hit him till he got all twitchy. He'll be fine in a year or two. That's a long time. You just let the old janitor know if anyone else has anything to say about uh, his spelling. I don't think that will happen again. Oh, these glasses fell off the nerd's face when I hit him. You can have him. These old eyes don't miss a thing. Alright, now I can give him to the cafeteria lady. How you doing there, Sonny? Want some tea? No. Like what? I found some glasses. Cool. Come back quickly. Oh, cool. I can see something behind the air vent. You unscrew the vent, man. Hints. Nugget will give you the ki will give you King Tower Beetle if you bring him a magnifying glass during morning time. Cindy will give you Doom Jelly if you put gum in Lily's hair and get back to her during lunch. Unscrew the air vent in the hallway. You need to have special items for Monty and Bugs in order to get to complete Lily's mission. 
a box in the janitor's closet and it's five bucks in it. You need a special item from the teacher before you can complete a uh, bug's mission. Tell them bugs for robbing you. Okay, okay. Bugs, Monty, and Lily should all be eliminated during lunch. Lily should be eliminated after Bugs and Monty by knocking on the principal's door. Alright, let's try that out. Do nothing. Alright, well that was that was short lived. Oh, it's locked. What? What the poop? Unless what? Well, I'm not a cigarette. If you have some, I'd be willing to give them to you. Looks like we gotta go visit the principal. I'm sorry. Me too. Me too. Why are you so sorry? Uh. Okay. Jesus. Please don't sit with me. I don't want to talk to anyone until I find my brother. Alright, so what? Same same deal? Make him basically kill that kid. What incident? Oh, well, you see, that little girl's dog. Well, I told her she couldn't have him in school, so I brought him to my closet until her mom could pick her up. Okay, the little thing bit me. Well, he escaped. Yeah, escaped. Are you eating the dog? What? No, nonsense. And the fact that the little dog he's name was Biscuit is just a cruel irony. Just forget about it. Get away from my stand. It's a recipe I came up with myself. I have it written down on a piece of paper in a box in my closet. Now if you ain't gonna be if you ain't gonna buy one, skedaddle. Can't even sell nothing. All right. Didn't want to sit with you anyway, cheerquad. All right, so let me get one of these. Now I have to go to the bathroom. All right, glasses. Just a, <laughs> a hunch I have. I'm always creepy. Just give her a damn biscuit. Did you drug it or something? What? Of course not. I'm not that kind of janitor. This is something else. Something a bit more entertaining. Forget it. I need to sell Monty. I need to sell Monty something so I can get some cash. Throw away this lab. Smart. Got anything else? Well, the menu is kind of restricted right now. Oh, the new regulations. I have a chocolate bar, but it's pretty darn. Oh, God. Why is it so expensive? It's all part of the government wanting you kids to be less fat. You poor things are wasting away before my eyes. Uh, never mind that. Let me see if she got anything else. Uh, what's in it? It's an old family recipe. Lots of herbs and spices and salt and about 89% the principal secret ingredient. 89% is a lot. Oh, it's not that much. Supposedly it keeps the slap in regulation with the government's new health standards. What's the secret ingredient? I can't tell you. It's a secret. Also, I have no idea what it is either. You're feeding us a seasoned mystery ingredient? But the seasoning is so good. It's the best part. I'm not eating it. Well, that's your call. I can't make you eat it. I'd love it if you did, but it's fine. Just move along. Um, um, yeah, sure. Wait, 
throw it away. Is she gonna give me something? Sure. My word. Even Bugs doesn't need my slop with that much enthusiasm. It's delicious. I think you've earned something special. My way of saying thank you for appreciating the slop. Here's a monster mod card. Now go on and finish that slop, and don't worry, I'll be serving it again tomorrow. Yippee! Okay, kiddos, that's the recess spell. Go burn off all the delicious slop you just ate. It clacked. It clacked. That just happened. Don't bother me, kid. I'm trying to figure this out. Figure what out? It's this riddle about these stupid duck things. Apparently, if you shake them in the right order, something is supposed to happen. What's the riddle? Go twice the duck that's furthest south, then two blue before red. After, return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong, and you're dead? Go twice the duck that's furthest south, then two blue before red. After, for, after return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong, and you're dead. So, quack, quack. Quack, quack. 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 Yeah, good luck solving that. I don't want to get involved now. Now that I think about it. Hmm. Alright, so let's try one. One. Oh shit, wait, no. That was wrong. Sorry, I meant this one. Duck. Duck. Two. One. Jesus Christ! That was not the solution, apparently. I'm gonna try again. Start the mission. I think I got it though. Alright, so it's gonna go one, two, one, two, one, two. Go twice the duck that's further south, then two bef ten, then two blue before red. After return to the first duck, oh, uh, then blue. Monster mount guard. Nailed it. <laughs> Pick it up. Alright guys, I'm gonna have to leave this episode here if you like this episode comment back for more um i really like this game it's dark humor it's funny it's kind of adorable uh the music in the background is hilarious considering all the stuff that's going on um yeah uh, if you like this video please like and subscribe don't forget if you want to be a derp subscribe down there become a derp today and I will see you guys in the next video of Kindergarten.